Ladies and gentlemen, I think I may have just potentially found the best lead scraping method in 2023, 2024. So the benefits of watching this video and implementing what I'm about to share is that not only is the lead quality absolutely insane, it's super simple and effective to actually do. It's not complicated compared to these other YouTube videos out there. It's completely free and per unit of time spent, which means that the amount of energy, minutes and times compared to the actual results, so the amount of leads we can generate is once again, it's crazy because we're going to be leveraging ChatGPT and automation. And I promise you, you will not have seen this method anywhere else, especially the automation side. So part two of this video that I'll be covering later in this video. So being an agency owner myself, I've tried pretty much every lead scraping software tool, whatever it may be out there. And let me tell you something. It gets very expensive very quickly. Before you know it, you're paying $79 for Apollo and then you realize that they make you pay for exports on top of that. It's crazy. Like when I first started my journey, like I got so confused in the, you know, crowded space of, you know, how to generate leads that I generally had no idea how to do it. So the goal of this video is to just give you a simple way that's completely free. And this is by far out of my, you know, year and a half of doing this. It's by far the best way of doing it. Like, it's crazy. So the main problem isn't the fact that it's expensive. Yes, that's not the best. But the main, main problem, right, is that you are getting the same lead list as every other agency owner in the same niche as you. For example, let's say you're in the real estate niche and you use the same lead scraping softwares, which you probably do, like D7 Lead Finder, Apollo, Lead Swift, Lead Kahuna, all these platforms and softwares, those are what other agency owners use. So when they search for the same niche, they're going to get the same lead list as you, which means that the prospects you reach out to have already been messaged hundreds, if not thousands of times before by agency owners, which leads to overexposure and classical conditioning. So the prospects, the leads you're reaching out to is that they've already been messaged before, emailed, cold called, whatever it may be, and they've become numb to basically agencies. So how can we overcome this? Well, I'm going to share it with you and I'm excited to get into this. So this is by far the number one lead gen method 2024. Um, and the pros is that this works for all niches. Um, it's completely free. You get their first name, email, phone number and any other socials you want into a Google sheet. And it's great for beginners because it's so simple and effective. Now keep watching because it's going to get insane. And it's automated, by the way. So the instructions are here, right? And um, we've got one because first of all, to be honest, you need to understand how to do this um manually and then we can automate it in this video later on which i've got instructions down here but what you're going to do is you're going to go to google right and you're going to put your niche and then the uh, brackets at gmail.com if we want their gmails if we want their phone numbers we can do you know at phone number.com no sorry at phone number but essentially go to google and let me remove myself so you can see what I'm searching here. But let's use roofing as an example for a niche. You would put whatever niche you're in and just replace it. So you're going to type roofing, right? And then you're going to do that and then at gmail.com. Now, what this is going to do, right, is when we click search, it's going to have a bunch of roofing at websites. And it's also got their phone number. So as you can see, yeah, advanced roofing services at gmail.com. We've got, you know, Aaron roofing at gmail.com. We've got, I think you get the point, right? You've, you've literally got like tons and tons of roofing companies right here who you can reach out to. Like there's loads. But the best part, like look how many there are. And they've all got like their own personal like Gmails and phone numbers as well. So you can do the exact same thing by just putting phone number in here because it's a keyword. So if you search phone number, you'd get the same thing, right? So what you're gonna do is obviously we don't wanna have to manually copy and paste this into a Google Sheet because that would take way too long. And yeah, we don't have that much time. Or maybe you do, I don't. So let me show you how you're gonna do this. You're gonna do control A. So you're gonna make it go like that. Then we're gonna go back to the instructions. And by the way, if you want these instructions, then just drop me a DM on Instagram. Give me a follow as well. Why not? Um, and I'll just send you this Google Doc because it, trust me, it helps when you have the instructions in front of you because you can just copy it. So yeah, DM me on Instagram and I'll basically give you these, this, uh, this Google Doc. So next, you're going to want to, so we basically, we've done control A to highlight all the information. Now control C to copy. Now we're going to go into chat GPT and click control V. However, we're going to say 
um, format this data into um, a CSV after with company, phone number, email, and website. So this is what we're going to get in the Google Sheet. We can also do first name, but let's go to ChatGPT now to make it easy. We've got a brand new thing here, and we're going to basically um, let me go back because I accidentally did that. So once again, Control A, Control C to get all the information on this page. Go into ChatGPT, Control V, click Enter. And as you can see, it has basically got all the different ones like this. So it's already done the hard work, right? Because it's got the things. However, we want to make this look a lot cleaner. So what we're going to do is we're going to look how many leads, by the way. And that's just the first page. We're going to automate this. So we'll do the second page, third page, fourth page, fifth page, sixth page. You get the point here. And we're going to use automation to do the rest of this. Um, so what you're going to do is you're going to go here and you're going to copy this. So... Where is it? Here it is. So format this data into CSV like that. So when we paste this into ChatGPT like this, what it's going to do is if you wait, it's going to give you this. Now, I'll skip to the part once it's done now. Okay, so now it's basically just giving you all the leads in, the, uh, in this CSV format. So what we're going to do, right, is we're going to copy this. So I believe it says copy code here, and then we're going to go to a notepad. Um, for example, I've just gone to online notepad.org um, and what you're going to do is you're going to copy this and paste it into this Google Sheet so it looks like this. But now we need to download this as a CSV because you can't really download it from ChatGPT. So that's why we're using this notepad. So you're essentially going to go here, click save. Um, you can call this whatever you want. Let's just call it roofing. And once again, you can use this for any niche like personal trainers, uh, gyms, real estate, yeah, plumbing, like e-com, whatever you want, like this works and it's completely free. So roofing and then you're going to do, yeah, you can just call it whatever you want. I'll just call it uh, leads. Click save. And as you can see here, it's basically downloaded it up here as a CSV. So not only do we have, um, we can basically now just go here, file, um, and I believe it's import. And yeah, just upload it as a CSV. Now you may be asking me, Charlie, how can we automate that? So not only is that insane, right? Because I've basically... Um, giving you a way of finding unlimited leads completely free using ChatGPT. However, if you're an OG of my channel, you know that I made a similar video on this a few months ago. However, I found something even better. And this is the craziest part yet. If you thought this was good, because it basically just gives you like hundreds of leads automatically, we, I found a better way. And it's basically a way of automating that, but we can do it tenfold. So it's insanely powerful here. And what you're going to do is you're going to download even Merga. This is completely free if you're a Mac user. Or you can download J uh, Jitbit for non-Mac users. And what these are, these are macro recorders. Means that basically what we've done there, we can automate that and just give it to that um, to do the same thing over and over again and repeat it as many times as we want. So the instructions is once you've downloaded it, um, I recommend Merga. It's so much better than Jitbit. But if you don't have a MacBook, then you just have to use Jitbit basically or another macro recorder um, or you can just do it yourself manually like what I've just done because it is sort of automated already but I wanted to go one step further and give you this information. Um, now, as I talked about earlier, right, there's going to be different pages. So obviously we don't want to automate the same page but when we go right to the bottom, if we keep going, there'll be like page two, for example, um, which means that this is one page but there'll be another page with you know similar results but not the same companies. So that's what we want. So what we've got here in a Google Sheet is roofing one, roofing two, and these are for all the different pages, right? Now, if um, if we go back into the instructions, um, you need to make sure you have the tab. So when you run this automation through Merga or Jitbit, you need to make sure that the, um, the tabs, so as you can see up here, are in the same place every time. Otherwise, it will mess up the placement of the automation. Um, and you also, if you're using Merga, don't go on your phone because it's sort of connected. So yeah, it'll mess it up once again. Um, and yeah, just follow what I do now very carefully. So close any tabs you are. If you're on TikTok because you're addicted to social media, then turn that off um, and just watch this now um, for literally like two minutes. It's not going to take long. And also, you may have to do it a few times to get good at it. Um, so yeah, let's do this. So what it's going to look like is you're going to want to open Merga. So I've got Merga up here. Um, and essentially, yeah, in the background for Discord, you know, I've got a free Discord, so feel free to join that if you want. Um, but yeah, essentially, 
This is Murga, right? And we can basically play back the recording as many times. So I recommend making a key to start and stop. So for example, I've done command R and that means that we can record what we've just done and play it back, if that makes sense. I'm trying to make this really simple. Um, and you've got command S, which basically means to, um, you know, play that recording as many times as we want. So it will repeat what we've just done in terms of going on Google, finding roofing companies, finding their emails, putting it into ChatGPT, putting it into the notepad, and it's gonna do that for you. So we can repeat this as many times as we want, but I'm just gonna repeat five times. So now the amount of leads we just created in that CSV is gonna do that fivefold automatically through automation. So we've got Command R and Command S, and it's gonna repeat it five times. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna go here and we're gonna make sure we uh, close this tab. So now, let me move my mic so I can have full access to this. Walk through now of how the automation works. Stay tuned because this is gonna be crazy. So once you're on your Google Sheet, have your niche just in the, in the you know, rows here essentially. So you've got roofing, roofing, roofing. And then the reason we have one, two, three, four is just because it will basically put a different page. So like what I was speaking about before about the, the search we got from the first lead list, was just one page. So we can automate this to do page two, three, four, five, six automatically without having to do anything. So we just have to do it once basically. So what this will look like is place your thing on here. So put your cursor on the first one and then you're gonna put your cursor anywhere on this page. Just make sure it's the same place you do it when you end the recording basically. So it does the same thing. So let's just use L for an example. Once you put your cursor on the set place and you've got your uh, column selected, you're basically going to click Command R because that's gonna start a recording. Now I'm gonna do this, I'm gonna have to do this quickly to speed it up. Otherwise, if I do the automation while speaking, it's gonna do it really slow. So I'm gonna speed this up um, and just go for it quickly and basically explain to you as I'm doing it. So I'm gonna click Command R and as soon as I do that, I'm gonna press down on my um, keypad, not the cursor, so we're not going down to click on this. We're gonna use the um, the cursor, as you can see on my keyboard, down and it's gonna do the same thing. But let's put it back on the L and click Command R to start the recording. Recording started. So down, you're gonna Control C, Control T to open a tab, click G for Google. Now once you're here, you're going to Control V and you're going to put boom and then at Gmail dot com space and then you're going to go back here you're going to go across not using the cursor c and then you're going to go back onto google v paste now it's basically got a brand new one you're going to control c just like what you did last time and go to chat gbt and go to the bottom control v and paste now we're going to go back onto google sheets actually no we're not going to go back into google sheets we're, so it's essentially it's already done it for us because I said format into CSV. So now we can just copy the code, copy code, go to your notepad, control V, click file, save, save as whatever you want leads and click save and now it's just done it. Now you're gonna close the Google, go back to this Google Sheets, go across without the cursor and put your cursor back on L because that's where we started and stop it. Recording stopped. Now I've just done the automation. So now I can literally go for a walk, go to a gym and play this back as many times I want and it'll get as many leads as you want for free in your niche into a Google Sheets for you or as a CSV. Um, so let's run this. So Command S will play this back. So Playback started. I've pressed Command S, I'm not touching anything. As you can see, it's gonna copy the lead. I'm not touching anything. This is literally an automation where it's gone onto Google right now. It's going to put roofing, but this time it's gonna do roofing at gmail.com free instead of two, which means that it's gonna get the third page from Google, not the second page, which means that we're gonna get brand new leads. And this is automated, I'm not touching anything. I could literally go for a, like a walk, I could go to the gym and let this do it. This is by far the most effective way to get free leads in 2024, and it's absolutely insane. So it's copying the information from the page it's going to go onto ChatGPT. It's going to go to the bottom. It's going to literally paste it into ChatGPT. I'm not touching anything. Um, and it's going to go back onto, no, I didn't actually want it to go onto Google uh, Docs. But as you can see, it's going to copy the code. 
Like, look how insane this is. And it's going to basically paste it and save as a thing. Um, all you need to do is just make sure you clear it at the end of the automation. Close the tab. Once again, it puts it back. And I could let this run for as long as I wanted. And it would do the same thing over and over again. Um, and it's insane. Because look, it's literally, look, it's gone on to number four now. So this is going to do page four while I'm not doing anything. I could literally go eat food. I could, it is nuts. Like, hopefully you can share my enthusiasm here because it's pretty insane for getting leads um so i can let this run all day and get as many leads as i want really easily however i'm going to stop the recording and yeah so basically it's insane long story short Le please leave a like and comment if you got into this stage because yeah it's pretty crazy now yeah make sure you follow these steps um and once again go uh, dm me on instagram if you want this instructions because yeah it's much easier to follow and also if you don't want to run this automation for some reason, let's say you're on, you know, uh, non-Mac and it's a bit complicated for you, go on to Upwork and you can basically get a VA for $4 an hour, let's say from the Philippines, which is their average wage, and get them to do it. So the best part is you can send them this video and just get them to do this. And I think I, I did the maths right. So per hour, you can basically get 200 free leads doing this, which means that for 10 hours, you could get 2,000 leads from personal, whatever, emails, phone numbers of your niche. And they usually charge $4 an hour, which means that if you can't do the automation for some reason, just go on Upwork, get a VA, and it would basically be $40 for 2,000 um, personal leads, which is pretty good value. Like, that's pretty good. Um, but yeah, hopefully you found this video insane. Um, it was, you know, really fun to record it. Um, we're almost at uh, 5,000 subscribers, by the way, so click the subscribe button. Um, I post very valuable content that's helped me because um, that's sort of the goal of the channel here. So yeah, leave a like, comment and subscribe. Um, and yeah, once again, if you want all this, you know, Google Doc, then just DM me on Instagram and I'll send it over. Um, and give me a follow on Instagram, why not? But yeah, hopefully this video helps and I'll catch you in the next video. Peace.